Hello my ticket boom booms. I just unboxed my boxy lux. It's already live. Go check it out. And I was like, okay, you know what? I'm gonna leave the base box for tomorrow. I thought about it. I can't resist not diving into the box and actually swatching and trying like first impression stuff. So we are gonna unbox the base box. You guys already know the spiel. It was sent to me in PR so that I can unbox, review, and reveal for you guys. Therefore, I did not pay for this box. However, my reviews are always 100% honest. And if you're new here, go check out the beauty unboxing playlist. I promise you <laughs> I've had moments. I didn't give uh, products and or boxes the best reviews but that's being 100% honest and my people like totally agreed with me and if you're new please make sure you are subscribed hit the subscribe button hit the notification bell selecting all notifications that way YouTube lets you know every single time I provide an update over on my community page or upload a brand new video I upload about six days a week sometimes I get sassy and I upload a seventh video on Sundays just for fun if you can please hit the like button it really helps me out it tells YouTube I like her content I like the vibe they'll recommend my to more people that helps with growth and all that jazz and please comment as we go because i really want to hear you guys' thoughts so we are gonna this is the december base charm cajita it's the one that's red on the inside the theme is tis the season for being extra and i'm pretty extra here on the channel like more than normal people and if you didn't see the premium unboxing don't sleep on that go check it out i'm telling you like we're on top of it and we're on top of it early i want to make sure that if you guys like the products if you guys want to snag anything you can i do have a link in the description box down below for you guys just to make it easier for you guys to navigate over to the boxy charm website and yes it is an affiliate link but if you don't want to use it totally get it and if you choose to use it it basically tells boxy charm oh Jotty referred me and so they give me a little bit of a commission other than that that's really it and I think you guys are really gonna be excited over this variation if you like the other two variations based on the price point of those boxes then I think you'll really enjoy this one the first product is by real her it is the set your girl gr gr <laughs> set your goal blurring veil the card says this retails for 25 doll hairs it is a setting powder. It is a blurring veil. Is it translucent? What are you? Features ultra finely milled powders, which melt into the skin to set your makeup in place or control excess oil. It's completely flashback and talk free to give any look some serious staying power. My thing is, I have so many powdered products that are already open and I just bought a new one because I'm an idiot. Although I really like it. It's on my skin and it's really nice. So this is what it looks like. It doesn't say that it's translucent, which I'd be curious about. Am I going to try it? Probably. If it's not translucent, this would be a really good shade for me because it's supposed to melt into your skin and your makeup. But if it's translucent, it's going to work for everyone. If it's not, it might not work for everyone. I got a skincare product. It is by Murad. And this retails for $89 hairs, which of course it's what really like boosts the price point of this box. This is what it looks like. I'm not going to open it. I'm not going to pump it. I already own it. It's in my bathroom. I've been doing like this retinol thing and it's definitely working for my skin. My skin is loving it. There's this whole thing I learned on TikTok. It's a thing. It's a thing, but it's working. Retinol is one of those things that you really need to start implementing into your skincare if 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 you're willing to and able to 25 and up start early i'm 36 i just started <laughs> so don't judge me i started a few months ago but it's never too late so don't sleep on it and this is 89 dollars. yes retinol can be expensive this bumped up the price point of the box now let's go on to the next item this is the seraphine botanicals persimmon and plump glass finish lip Glade. The card says it retails for $24, a lip treatment and gloss hybrid that gives you a wet vinyl glass like wet shine without thickness or heaviness. I don't know. Let's see. Let's see what she looks like. I have so many lip products that are actually open right now and it's so annoying. But of course, the job is to kind of check things out and tell you what I think and then swatch them. So what did you think we're going to do right now? We're going to swatch it. You have a very chunky applicator and then I'll do a mini like swatch at the bottom. I want you guys to kind of see what's going on on in there it has a very faint hint of sweet but it's not really fragranced and this is what to expect if you were to receive this in your box i'm not sure that if there's going to be a variation based on color or anything like that or if this is just a standard but that is what it looks like it, ha it definitely has shimmers to it because i can see the little shimmers you know what it's one of those products that if you really wanted to hydrate your lips and you're like man i don't want to apply a liquid lipstick or an actual lipstick because my lips are too chappy and too dry you can apply this with a little bit of lip liner and pull it off and it'll look really beautiful it is a very flattering shade and it's going to work for everyone because it has a little hint of like peachiness to it 
but it's still very sheer, if you will. I think it's pretty. I think it works. Then I got brushes by the brand LaRousse. The card says it's a special edition three-piece eye brush set and it retails for $38. Special edition, maybe because it's the holidays, it's a special edition, I don't know. <laughs> I brush. The way they packaged it, it's crooked. That's really funny. So this actually looks the way their brushes typically look, except the handle and stuff is different. So the ferrule is usually like silver and then the handle would either be pink it's been like a medium ish kind of like a like a dusty blue they've had black and i've also seen gray so the special edition i guess because it's the holiday and it's christmas you get it in like a cranberry shade and then the ferrule is not even rose gold it's kind of like a orangey silver situation it's pretty their brushes are nice they're really soft these have to be cleaned of course and this one needs to be straightened because it's like i don't know it came out sideways a little bit larousse brushes are always good to receive i have zero complaints over the larousse brushes and i remember when i initially started receiving larousse i was getting it in ipsy and every time i got them i was like i don't need them i don't need them but funny enough i kept getting the same freaking brush set i got them like four times and in the end i was like you know what i keep putting them in giveaways because i don't need new brushes but it's like destiny i need to try try them because I keep freaking getting them. And once I got them, I fell in love with the brushes. They were so good. They were like face brushes. And at that point I was like, okay, every time I get LaRousse brushes, I will try them. And a lot of people are trying to build their brush collection. So the more brushes, the better. Absolutely. I think it's a really good item to feature in the box along with the very last item, which a lot of people are really excited for. And it is an eyeshadow palette by Dominic Cosmeticals. This is the unconditional palette. It features six shades. You're going to get mattes. You're going to get shimmers. And you're going to get a glitter, but before I show you guys like what the palette actually looks like, and it's not just a picture, I want you guys to see the exterior of the package. It is so pretty. Like the packaging is really, really pretty. When you open her up, that is what she is going to look like. And I think this palette is going to be really nice for those of you who want that glitter for like Christmas and or New Year's. It's freaking perfect and look i just like you guys saw the little swirl and look at the coverage that i got on my finger i'm gonna do one of these because being realistic i'm not trying to ruin my eyeballs i know it's late this is gonna come off it's fine but i worked really hard on the eyes i just pat and look how insanely beautiful that pressed glitter is and then you have these other shades which of course you can definitely go full on matte or you can use some of the shimmers and go super frosty with cranberry for the holidays you can use this palette at all given times you don't have to wait for the holidays just to use it i think she's beautiful i think this is a really nice palette to include in the box and the thing about it is i'm glad they did dominique cosmetics with the other products that were featured for premium and luxe this box needed to stand on its own and i think they did a really really good job the variation featured makeup and skincare but it was more makeup over the skincare which is absolutely amazing and i know all of you guys are really into the makeup now especially you we're all trying to get glam so i think this variation was really well thought out and this is most definitely a beautiful variation that you can gift for the holidays so just keep that in mind it's a great christmas gift that people can use for new year so those are ideas listen overall the variation was beautiful i don't really have complaints on the product it's so crazy because i feel like these beauty boxes really hit it out of the park this month at least the ones that i've unboxed so far they've done a really good job featuring specific products products that you can use to create almost a full face if not a full face incorporating them into creating beautiful looks listen i feel like it's really christmas like everything is so beautiful and that's just me saying it and know that i have rotating product moving around and i was pretty impressed i, I i'll say that i don't know i want to hear what you guys think are you guys excited for your base box are you guys excited for like your boxy charm boxes in general? Let me know down below. Don't forget, I have the boxy lux, the boxy premium already live on the channel. So you might want to go check that out while you're at it. Stay tuned because we're going to be unboxing Ipsy next. I really hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. Please don't forget to hit the like button for me again. It really, really helps me out. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye guys.